Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, co and welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2 video of awesome and in interest. Let's go. Um, the first thing that I wanted to do today was get another plot of land. Um, we've been doing the ice trees, the frost trees, to kind of uh, fill out our land and get us get us the money that we needed. And today, Reuven, I've got the money for you, buddy. Hey there, Reuven. So you want some land, eh? Yes, I do. You already have some land. Do you want to expand your land? Yes, I want to expand. So, um, this is going to cost us 12,000. <sighs> Let's purchase it. 12, 13, 14, 15. So the next one's going to be 15,000, I think. It adds 3,000 every single time. So, yes, I want to expand my land. 15,000. Ooh, we're getting bigger. We're getting bigger. So, um, yes, purchase. But before I do, wait, can I go out to the sides? I can go out to the sides. Okay. So let's go ahead and purchase that one right there. Ooh, now we got to build on it. Okay, okay. Um, I do not have enough for a, a third, but that leaves me with 10,000. That's still a lot of cash. So. Uh, I remember having to do the uh, the lava wood run to try and get all this to this money for the trees or for the base, and that took forever. So, oh, I feel a tickle on my nose. Oh, am I gonna sneeze? Oh, maybe, maybe. Who knows? If I do sneeze, that's a that's a free wish. So today is just going to be a nice, gentle, relaxed day of building awesomeness. Sitting back, relaxing, and having fun. Oh, and I think today is going to be my only video. Because, um, you know, I don't want to stress myself out. I don't want to push too hard. And it's, a, it's been a very busy week. Um... We've been, uh, oh, I've been cleaning out the garage, uh, my studio, to expand, uh, to, to get it ready for the big move come this summer, and there's a lot of stuff that I was holding on to that I didn't realize I was holding on to for no reason. Um, and it's not, I, I need to stop referring to it as junk, because, I mean, it's, it was memories, and it's, it's stuff, it's my stuff, but... A lot of it really was just junk. It was a a bunch of computer parts and stuff that I, I, I thought, you know, I need to hold on to this because um, someday I'm going to want to rebuild that old Windows XP box for some reason. No, I'm not. No. Um, I was never going to go back and rebuild a Windows XP box. Well, I could turn it into an emulator or something. Or, no. No, I wasn't, you know? <clears throat> As I was going through all my old electronics and all my old stuff, I began to realize I didn't need nor want a lot of the old computer parts and pieces. Why was I holding on to it for so long? So, it felt good. It felt really good to get rid of like 20 boxes of electronics that I mean, I don't even use telephone cable anymore. Why am I keeping the telephone routers and, and modems and stuff? I don't know. Just me, I guess. So, Anyhow, that's what I've been doing most of the day. Whoa. Careful. Most of the weekend. Because I started in on it on Friday and took everything up to... Uh, the computer recycling center. It was nice. Anyhow, how's your guys this weekend? Was it good? <clears throat> uh, I've been coughing and hacking like crazy because uh, of, of all the dirt and um, dust that was inside this place, and it's been kicked up. So my allergies are going crazy, but I feel okay. I'm good. I'm all right. Um, 
I'm not gonna need that much, am I? Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Mr. Tree. I completely destroyed your entire existence for a, a little piece of wood. I'm only gonna need like one of these. So. Come on, come on, buddy. Come on. No, I've already got another piece, uh, another land plot. Should I just go for the wood itself? I think the next one's going to be uh, walnut. And then the, the pine and the, um, what is it? Pine and the other one. Oh, oh, that was a nice little fall. Did you, did you guys see that? That was, that was awesome. All right, what's this? Put this on the back. Uh-oh, uh-oh, come on. Lift, drop. Um, we've already done birch. We've already done oak. We've done... We oh, done lost a mine. Um, elm. What else did we do? Cherry. Cherry. We did cherry tree. So. Next we're going to do some lava. Hot lava! And then, uh, I think I'm going to go over and do the walnut tree next. That's, that's all the main area trees, isn't it? Because the only thing across the bridge is, is walnut, elm, and oak. I think. No, I can I can never remember. Hold on. That's a bad bad parking job. We need to park next to that. There we go. There we go. Alright, and what is this set to? Is this set to bigs? No. Let's set this back down. We want one by twos by ones. There we go. That'll work. That no, way it's slightly bigger. Oh, oh dear. Oh dear, 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 dear. You are not... Yeah, that's not... Uh oh. Okay. Well, we're going to have to glitch it out. So if you guys don't know about the glitch, uh, you just E to move it. And then once you are you got it moved, you bring it down and you press B. And it gets it stuck inside and there. Oh. Come on, come on, slide to the left. Slide to the right. Crisscross. Everybody clap your hands. Hold on. Maybe if I lift. Lift. I have to keep lifting. Lift. There you go, buddy. So it gets stuck if it, it if it touches something. And so every once in a while you have to take something underneath here and kind of lift it up. There you go. All right. Whoa! Careful, buddy. Careful. Actually, here let's uh, let's chop this in two down here so it's a little bit more stable, not unstable like it is right now. And let's move this in here. Blink. All right. Oh, that was a lot of wood for what we actually needed it for. But that's okay. We'll be good. Always, uh, my first base, I can remember back whenever I first started Lumber Tycoon 2, I actually, I started building with the, uh, the lava wood. I thought, how impressive would it look if my entire base was made out of lava? Oh, they would, they would all be so impressed. And then uh, later on, it was the gold wood. I was like, oh, I can, I can build my entire base out of gold wood. They'd be so impressed. <coughs> Silly me. Here we are, what, six years later? Building with all the woods. If you had asked me back then if you think I could have be uh, if I thought I could have become a YouTuber, I would have told you no. I always said, nah, there's no way. There is no way anybody would want to watch me do this. Um, I know I haven't thanked him enough. Like, I know I've thanked him a lot in the past, but I've, I haven't thanked him recently. 
Blobby890. I know a lot of you don't know who that is, but the first ever YouTube video of Lumber Tycoon 2 is of me and him going and getting the Goldwood. How to get the, oops, how to speed run Goldwood or something like that. Fastest way to get Goldwood. And that video blew up, but if you guys don't know the story, that's sad. Um, no, me and him were playing inside Lumber one day and he, uh, he goes, well, or no, he'd asked me about YouTube and stuff and, and I told him that I was a little embarrassed that I had stopped um, recording my other videos to come and play Lumber. I was a little embarrassed about it. He goes, well, why not just record this? And I was like, record Lumber? It's like, yeah, record record one right now. Let's just, let's see how it does. And that was, that was the first Lumber video on my YouTube channel, so. For Blobby890, huge shout out. He, he has my attention he, anytime. If he needs anything at all, thank you. He's the one that actually pushed me to uh, come out here and play for the first time. Or not, not play, to, to record it. So. Memories. <sighs> no, sorry. I, I didn't mean to get all sappy on you. My bad. But it really is. True stories of Code's past. Hmm. We're supposed to be having a news channel come out today. Um, I don't think that we're going to be able to get it to uh, up to par by the time it comes out. So I thought, you know, if we record on the weekends, then we'd have uh, we'd have the whole weekend to get it all edited and put out. But you know what? It's hard. It is hard to put together a news channel to. Impress the people. Is that the last one? Let's just throw the whole thing in there. Boom. There we go. <clears throat> but it's just for fun. And it's just us, me and Jack are messing around and trying to get a, a nice news channel to get that nostalgic feeling of RNC back. Because uh, the Roblox news channel, it used to be Midget and Cineac, and, and they passed it off. And the feel of the news channel changed. No offense to the guy that's doing it now, but it just, it, it now feels like a regular YouTube channel or a regular Roblox YouTube channel. It doesn't feel like that newscasting feel. Which me and Jack come to find out, um, can't really write articles. <laughs> it's, it's hard for us to put together some articles to, to throw up there. <laughs> okay, I need a, ah, there we go, a walnut tree. Hello, walnut tree. And we don't need the whole thing, so let's chop right about here. There we go. Hopefully that'll, that'll be enough. I like the walnut for its nice chocolatey look. Like it's very, very brown wood. I like it. But next up, we'll have to do gold wood and um, zombie wood. I think those are the next ones. And then we've got. Uh, hold on. Is the gold wood and the zombie wood? They're not accessible except by uh, rock bridge and climbing, right? Ooh, how are we going to get... How are we going to get the, uh, the palm wood? Oof. Didn't think that went all the way through, did ya? Uh-oh, oh, excuse me, excuse me. Can you back up there, please? I wonder if that's too long. Is that, is that too long? It might be just too long. You know what? We're just gonna drop it in there anyway. Hopefully. Nope. Didn't work. Come back some. 
Move. Pull down. B. Ah, it worked. But we're gonna have to lift. Lift, 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 lift. Wait, is that it? Is that all I did? Okay. Well, it'll work for now. Oh, my goodness. Having the solo base is, is fun, but at the same time, it's it's a very lonely world. All around me are familiar faces. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Got to zoom out a little bit. Okay, let's just keep building here. Build, build, build. <laughs> hey, Dad, if you're watching, uh, did you want to come play some Roblox with me? I mean, if you want, it's, it's your choice. I was thinking, uh, cause I've watched him try to play Minecraft once before. And I didn't realize video gaming in general has a basic set of, of skill level that you need. And for somebody that like plays video games all the time, Anytime you encounter a new video game, there's some basic things that like make sense to me. Like whenever you you jump on an obby, right? You know that the momentum forward and, and stuff like that normally works the same in every game about the same way. So you know what to expect whenever you're you're fiddling with the controls or learning a new video game for the first time. And I never thought that video gaming or like gaming in general took a specialized set of skills just like guitar playing or piano playing or uh, model remote control um, plane racing dad uh, my dad used to do rc airplanes remote control airplanes very good at it he, he would go to competitions and races and stuff like that and i remember the quickie 500s that's uh, that's the planes that go faster and left, go faster and left, go faster and left. It had three pylons and you had to get around the pylons. You had to make sure that you weren't clipping the pylons and all these different rules. But I got to go with them up to Illinois one time at the, uh, the NATS, National Avionics something. NATS. I don't, I don't even remember what it stands for, but I do remember Getting to fly in a biplane, in a uh, one of the open cockpit planes, he uh, found a buddy, or found a guy that was flying the plane, and asked, "Hey, would you mind taking my son up and, and for a, a, a flight?" And the guy's like, "Yeah, sure, no problem." So that was one of the coolest experiences, and I had forgotten about it. Uh, <laughs> Mr. Coffee Bean! <laughs> oh no. No help on this base, please. No, no. This is a solo. <laughs> Thanks. Okay. Hopefully he'll leave me alone. Uh, 10,184. I won't, I know. Uh, I won't, I know what base you're on. Okay, cool. Coffee Bean's one of the uh, staff members over in my Discord, so. I think I'm gonna run out of wood here. I don't have enough to, to place everywhere. I was sitting here hitting the wood like, chop, and then I hear another chop, and I'm like, it echoed. That little piece of wood echoed. So, all right. Well, how much do we need? We really don't need that much, but that'll be fun. What was I talking about? Nats, nats. Anyhow, um, back to the original point. Um, <clears throat> video, video games do take a special skill set. And I was sitting there watching my dad try to play Minecraft and just seeing his, his like the way his hands were on the mouse and the keyboard and everything else. It just 
it was very enlightening as to how our generation learned to cope with video games, the WASD, the, the QWERTY keyboard, just kind of amazed me, you know? I didn't think back whenever I was 13 playing video games for the first time. Well, no, I've been playing video games since I was three, but playing on a keyboard for the first time. I didn't think that that would be a thing, you know? I didn't think, is this the same tree? Where's that piece of wood I chopped off? Is, was that it? Oh yeah, that's that's it. Okay, there's a little nub right there. Poor tree. I didn't think that it was going to be a skill set worthwhile of anything, you know? If you'd asked me back then, Code, do you think this is going to get you anywhere? I would have said no. I don't think so. Just, just playing and having fun. Sure enough. It's now a, a work skill set. Which is pretty cool. What I have a big 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 heart for what I what I <clears throat> take for granted is that I have all ten digits I have all ten toes I have all my fingers all my hands and stuff like that I want to give a huge shout out to all the gamers out there who struggle with some kind of handicap whether it's missing a finger missing an arm missing a leg missing a foot um, huge huge shout out to you because us as game developers and, and game designers we don't always think about like somebody that has a handicap and how it would affect you from playing um, one person in particular I can think of uh, his name's Keith I want to give a huge shout out to Keith all right I'm not gonna say his last name but he was a, a paraplegic growing up in in high school and him and his brother some of my best friends growing up he would play video games and him and his brothers would beat the crap out of each other on video games and he was a paraplegic like his hands he would take the controller put it down in his lap and then he had all the buttons everything that he needed to beat my butt <laughs> so huge shout out to anybody that's a handicapped gamer that's a that's a big accomplishment it's it's a big thing to overcome to me so I don't know I'm, I'm feeling very relaxed today because I, I didn't have such a good night last night. I was tired. My stream was affected, and I think everybody felt it. My dad even called. It was like, "Hey, I uh, heard you weren't doing so good on the stream." I'm like, "Yeah, I was a little out of it." I'm fine, fine. Grinning through through the the venom uh, mask the venom massage we're fine leave us alone <laughs> boom done two more plots of awesome all set and done man you know i didn't realize how long these kind of videos are taking but i also i'm very grateful for them because it's it's nice and easy it's taken a while, and you know what? It gives me a break to have to go and get more money all the time. So, I'm very happy about that. Keep an eye on that, that money score right there. Make sure that it doesn't change to the, uh, the next video, but I'm going to call it for tonight. Love you guys very much. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of videos like a good YouTuber does. But it's your choice. If you want to, go for it. If not, that's cool too. You were here, you watched, you had fun. I love you for that. I love you for being an individual and unique person. There's the only one of you in the entire world. And that's awesome. Have a great night. I'll talk to you soon. Outro. 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 Outro.
want some new merch? Check out teespring.com. Outro.